Told you guys I get a haircut and, and shave. But anyway, look, I want to thank you all for the feedback. I want to thank everybody who took the poll. It was overwhelmingly positive in favor of saying, hey, Adam, as long as you're honest, as long as you keep it real, go ahead and you know become an affiliate with that company. So I will be um, sending over the digital signature by tomorrow. And um, also tomorrow, I'm going to have a tutorial video out, a quick little one. And I, I mean, I just want to say like, look, I don't want to become like some of these other channels where they shill every single little pro plugin that comes out like that. That's never been what real home recordings have been about. Um, I don't even have the time. If I, even if I wanted to shill everything, I don't have the time to do it. So I always like the plugins that, you know, make my job easier, make something unique that nothing else to my knowledge offers or something that saves time, something that's, you know, significantly better than what, what what's out there so um you know and, and i'll just put it this way there's plugins that i've been wanting to review i think even back to like the summer of last year i was asked to review some plugins and i i will get around to them um and it's ones that i wanted to review i just didn't have the time to do it and you know so i gotta clear the black the, ugh, i have to clear the backlog out and, you know, basically anything new that comes out that I'm interested in, just try to ignore it. <laughs> that's, that's what my plan is. And, um, yeah, it's, I, I've become busier than I thought I would, especially considering everything shut down. But it's, it's ironic because, because things are shut down, it's like people that were putting off doing things that would require me are now doing them. If that makes sense. And I didn't expect this. And it, it's a good thing. But. Um, oh and another thing. I was asked to become an affiliate. Of that program. Like almost a month ago. And like I said. I just. I put it off. Because I, I didn't. I didn't know how you guys were going to react to it. And I just. Integrity means everything to me. Trust is everything in a relationship. You know that include that that's. Any relationship you can think of. Whether that's YouTuber to viewer or girlfriend, boyfriend, or wife and husband, whatever the case may be, if there's no trust, there's no relationship. So I will always have that trust in mind. I will, I'm, I'm committed to the truth. And I told some of you guys, basically what I'm going to do is if there's a plugin I think is good enough or unique enough to review, I'll review it. I'll say the pros and cons like I always have. And if for some reason it's not working properly or something i mean you know i'll definitely you know mail that into the developer and i just won't review it there there actually was a plugin that was sent to me about three years ago that simply did not work properly and i never reviewed it because why trash a company that might make amends in the future or whatever i, I don't know i just didn't think that was the right uh, bridge to burn but then there's other cases that happened where i inadvertently burned bridges and I really didn't mean to and I just was you know all, all because I was just asking questions other people weren't and you know like I said before I would rather tell the truth than make friends and I definitely have lost personal friends I've lost business relationships all because I was being honest and I mean I, I'm not going to sit here and say oh I'm 100% honest every single time when here I do I, at least I try to be but I'm saying in life, like, no, like some things I, I, I don't say and um, just to keep people's feelings in check. You know, I don't want to make people mad or cry. I try not to. I, I really do try. Maybe when I was younger, not so much. But um, anyway, I'm going off topic here. Thank you all. Um, I, I'm going to try to get two videos out this week. I really am going to try. One of those is a tutorial. Another one's a review for Denise Audio's uh, Perfect Room, which I like. And then after that, I think I'm going to take a look at Pulsair or Pulsair Audio. They have um, the Mu and Echo Rec or Echo Re. Yeah, I think it's Echo Rec, like record. So anyway, that's the plans, man.